Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you guys haven't been following this lowrider build, go ahead and follow it. There's a lot of information, a lot of good information. In this video, I'm going to be applying the candy. I'm also going to be mixing the candy. I'm going to show you how to do that. I'm going to show you the blend I'm going to do because I am going to be using two different types of candies. All right, let's just get started. All right, all right, let's get started. First, I guess you're wondering why I have a bucket. Well, I'm gonna be mixing two different types of candies. This is gonna be a special mix. It's gonna be some uh, cobalt blue with some oriental blue. Let me show you the mix. The reason I'm doing this is because the cobalt blue, whenever it's in the sun, it has a, like a purplish tint to it. I wanna take that purple tint to it out. What I wanna do, I'm gonna add some oriental blue That'll take the purple tin out and have just a real solid blue. There it is, there's our mix. I did use just half of the oriental blue and the in the cobalt blue, but the cobalt blue is a whole full gallon. So it's a gallon and a half of oriental blue to make that mix. After this, let's start mixing it up. This is mix 411, four parts of the candy, one part of the reducer, one part of the activator. Let's mix it up, pour it in the gun, Start shooting.
there you go I'm gonna wait 15 minutes for it to dry and uh, I'm gonna put like about four to five wet coats you saw me do it do not stop you go all the way around if you do stop you're gonna get a real bad uh, finish so don't stop just go go across and you'll be good but we're gonna wait those 15 minutes come back apply the second coat another thing that I'm gonna recommend is do a pattern to adjust your gun because that's gonna be critical on uh, throwing candy okay all guns are different so adjust them accordingly but you do have to make a pattern in order for you to get the perfect uh, spray so that you can start applying the candy This are four coats, a good way to see the results. Turn off the lights, I do have those, I can't turn them off from in here. But, get yourself a light and check them out. Now if you wanna put a, one more coat, that's fine. This is, these are four, I don't know. If to put another one or not, I'll check right now, but this is the way it looks. This is the other side. Hope the camera's picking it up, the way it looks. It looks real nice in person, but I hope the camera is picking it up.
So let me just check if I'm gonna put another one. If I am, it'll be just five coats and we'll be good. I decided I'm gonna add one more coat, which will be five. The customer does want it extremely dark blue, a very nice dark blue. So uh, that's what we're gonna do. One more coat, that'll be it. And we'll be good for the clear coat. There it is, five coats. I think I did the right call. Came out real nice. Looks real good. Now I'm just gonna let it set and top coat it, clear coat it. It'll be good, real nice. All right, let's top it off with some clear coat and I'll show it to you. There it is, the three coats are clear. Let me show it to you without the light. And I'll show it to you with the light. Looks real nice, really, really nice. There it is. Let me bring on the light. Turn off my lights, bring on the LED light so you can see it. There it is, this is with the light. Hope the camera's capturing all the metal flake and uh, the color. Looks real nice in person. Here's the other side. And this will be it. This will be it for this video. I hope you liked it. I hope you are enjoying these videos. There is going to be the next videos coming up. There's going to be the painting of the underneath of the trunk, underneath of the hood, inside the doors and everything. This car is going to have some uh, graphics, it's going to have some gold leaf, some silver leaf, so just stay tuned. If you guys enjoy these kind of videos, subscribe so you can see more. Also, uh, hit that thumbs up, it helps a lot, and uh, enjoy the rest of your weekend, alright? I'll see you next coming weekend, thank you, like always, God bless.